All right, all right, all right. Welcome to Frank's Crypto Corner, where we bring you all kinds of news and information about cryptocurrency. Mining the coin, staking the coin, using that credit card for BlockFi credit card to get rewards back in Bitcoin, all kinds of good stuff. Today, we're going to be talking about Dojal on Mars. Yep, a lot of good stuff going on, up about 11% in the last seven days, so we're going to cover that. Also, we're going to go to talked about on Twitter for the month of November, and guess what? Dojalon ranks at number seven. We're going to list the top 20, uh, who was the top, who was number 20, but Dojalon's right there at number seven. We're going to kind of go over that a little bit. We got a mystery whale that buys 1.2 trillion Dojalon Mars, valued at roughly around $1.8 million, so we're going to cover that a little bit, and, and we're going to cover the three reasons why the cryptocurrency has crashed in the last few weeks. What are the top three reasons why this could be happening? All kinds of good stuff happening today on Frank's Crypto Corner. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon so you don't miss out on any up-and-coming videos. Our goal on this channel is to help every single person learn about cryptocurrency, understand cryptocurrency, yep, and one day even own some cryptocurrency. So we bring you news and cryptocurrency stuff every single day at 1 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Uh, Monday through Friday, Saturdays and Sundays, it's around 3 to 4 o'clock. We bring you a bonus video once in a while, Monday through Friday, around 7 o'clock at night. So with that, hot cryptocurrency news brought to you every single day. Let's go over to Dogelon Mars. All right, over here at CoinMarketCap, take a look. In the last seven days, Dogelon is up 10%, now 11%. Now we do know that everything else is red, 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 red. Well, Dogelon is up. In the last 24 hours, it's up 2%, which is fantastic. Going over to the coin, again, up over here to the right, traded at, there's five zeros and 11.82. We'll give us our price prediction a little bit later. It's up almost 1.83%, almost 2%. So taking a look in the last seven days, what Dogelon's been doing down here, I mean, it was at down on the December 6th, and then it just skyrocketed. It jumped off the charts here, and then it's kind of leveled off. But again, taken from December 6th to now, it's way, way higher, which is fantastic. It's got a circulation supply of about 55%, 553, 254 billion um, at 55% circulation. Jumping over here, the top 20 most discussed cryptocurrencies on Twitter in the month of November of 2021. So we're going to take a look at this real quick, starting at the bottom. At number 20, Matic got about 1% of the um, people talking about. Number 19, Cardina, about 1%. Number 18, Algorand. The Sandbox at number 17, Mana, number 16, 1.1%. Phantom, about 1.1%. Pancake Swap at number 14. Number 12 is Avalanche at 1.6%. XRP is at number 11, coming up to Dojal on Mars. At number 10, Polkadot is 2%. Cardano, 2.9% BNB at number 8. And then take a look right here. Doge on Mars, number 7, moved up 5 positions in the last from one month to the next. Literally 3.1%, number 7. Might as well go up to the top. Uh, Safe Moon was at number 6, 3.1%. Dogecoin was up number 5, 3.7%. Bitcoin was uh, tweeted 6.7%. Solana is at number 3 at 8.3%. Ethereum's at number two, and Shiba Inu's number one spot at 16%. But take a look at Dogelon, number seven right there. Fantastic news. Well, take a look at this. A new Dogelon Mars whale is born. Buys 1.2 trillion coins worth 1.8 million. So, yep, there's another whale out there buying the Dogelon Mars. I mean, in record... 1.2 trillion coins worth 1.8 million. A mysterious, unidentified new Dogelon whale was born after purchasing 1.2 trillion coins valued at 1.8 million. To be precise, the whale purchased a whopping, again, 1.2 trillion, there's the exact number, over 1.8 million. The identity of the whale remains to be a mystery, and nobody knows if it's an individual exchange or a business entity. This is one of the biggest transactions recently re recorded in the Elon, and questions arise, is something big about to happen? That's why we're talking about it. So again, you got to put on your radar when whales are buying it like this. Holy cow, everybody. Here's going back on November 19th, a whale picked up 44 trillion Elons worth 80 million. I mean, that was a month ago. So you got whales picking up 44 trillion worth 80 million. 
And then this wheel is picking up 1.8 million. I don't know. Doge Line Mars going to the moon and going to Mars. And we got whales buying all kinds of, of trillions and trillions of coins. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon so you don't miss out on any up and coming videos. So give us your thoughts on that. What do you think about whales buying Doge Line? What do you think about last month in November, Doge Line being the seventh most talked about cryptocurrency on Twitter? I also think on that list right there, there's 20 of them. If you happen to be a crypto investor, you may want to look at those 20, probably some of those you already have. There may be five or six of those you may not have. Put them on your radar, track them for a month or two, watch the videos like this, all kinds of good stuff. All right, we're going to go ahead and jump over to three reasons why cryptocurrency could be down right now. So right here, Yahoo Finance, three reasons behind the crypto crash that dragged Bitcoin below 50,000. We're going to kind of uh, sum this up. Number one reason they say is the Fed. The first reason is the Fed. The first weakness in the planned vanilla equities is part brought by the Federal Reserve talking about investors spooked about the different assets. The U.S. Federal Reserve's tapping could burst into the Bitcoin and crypto bubble. So again, the Fed's talking about this and that and everything else. You know, and it says right here, he warned that Bitcoin price could drop below 10,000. Man, oh man. So number one is the Fed. Number two, COVID right here. Obviously, the new variant outbreak, when the uncertainty surrounding the severity of it, and how good are the vaccines? You know, some people believe the vaccines are working. Some don't believe it's working. Some are getting the boosters. Some aren't getting the boosters. You know, it's still to be determined. You know, also, basically, it has uh, investors running for the hills. I mean, people are, you got the feds and you got COVID. People are kind of like, ah, oh, man. The third reason could be the best reason. It says the holidays. Well, what does the holidays have to do with anything? Well, let's take a look. It says, tis the season. Many investors seeing the year winding down are looking to lock in the gains and take money off the table. After all, there's been a recent decline in Bitcoin, right? Bitcoin's below 50,000. Well, it's still up 66% from year to year. You know, Because last year, Bitcoin was around 29,400. So even though Bitcoin's up to 60 and down to 50 and up to 55 and down to 48, last year at the beginning of the year, it was at 29,400. So investors are trying to take profits off the table. They invested a year ago. They're taking some of the profits off the table. Where to go from here? It's very hard to tell. You know, for sure winter is coming, but is it a crypto winner? So yeah, give us your thoughts. You got the feds, you got the COVID, different variants of what's going on, the vaccines, the boosters, people are kind of unsure about things. And then you got investors from a year ago, maybe you want to take profits off the table. So give us your thoughts in the bottom. All right, let's go ahead and head back over to Dogelon Mars, give a little price prediction, and check out a couple of cryptocurrency prices. All right, back over here at Dogelon Mars here. It's up 12% right this second. So, you know, what's my price prediction? I mean, when you got whales that are buying this and you got so, much, plus, so many people talking about Dogelon Mars, the seventh most talked about token on Twitter last month, I still think we can crush one of these zeros here. So there's five of them. I think there could be four of them. That's my prediction. Again, all of my information is for educational purposes only. If you're going to invest, definitely reach out to a financial advisor. Again, information is for educational purposes only. Again, I want to take a look at Dogelon's new website. Take a look at how nice it looks right now. We got Crypto.com right here. Uniswap, KuCoins, OKEX. I mean, any of these right here, if you want to get Dogelon, you click it. Connect your wallet and shawam, you can get some Dogelon Mars. Right now, the rank of Dogelon is 120th rank. It's got a market cap of 652.43 million, a volume of 20.39 million. You know, in the quick start guy, create a MetaMask wallet, send ETH to your wallet, connect your wallet, and then swap it for ETH to get some Dogelon Mars or Elon. So yeah, there you go. Dogelon, whales are buying it, all kinds of good stuff. Give us your thoughts in the bottom, what you think of Dogelon. Do you own some Dogelon? Are you thinking about getting it? You can go to Uniswap to get it. All right, don't forget to share this video with a friend. Click right here to see our most recent video. And again, today being Monday, have a fantastic day today, everybody.